Trying to shot. Fucking oh, great save by Zippin. Now the ball played through for Marquez. One on one. Trying to chip it over Zippin. Bouncing. And it's headed over top of the net. Perfect setup for Jim Dreyer to stand up. There's three goals on the season. That one is crossed into the box. Knocked down. Fired it in. Off the corner kick. The Yellow Jackets will strike first on the road. That's the end of the game in your final score is the American International College Yellow Jacket 1, the Premier League University of Illinois. I think it's great, you know, I think after losing to Bentley, you know, we talk about five games left left for the seniors, what could we do to, to extend the season, and I think it started tonight, and I think the message the younger players brought a fight, and they were really there um, today, and it just shows that our future really looks bright moving forward. Yeah, it was just a quick shot. You know, it was a quick reaction save. Um, and then I knew I had to get up pretty quickly for the rebound. And luckily, my defender was able to clear it out quickly for me. Lisa called Nicole to go take the corner. I was set at the back, probably like five yards off the PK line. Nicole raised her hand, we made eye contact, and then I ran in front of my defender, and it kind of just like landed perfectly to my left foot. and slide into the back of the net on the left corner. I gotta say my defense is really solid. They do a really good job, whoever's back there. Um, they're not afraid to get hit. They're pretty solid and aggressive. They know the right plays to make and I trust them back there. I think us defensively changing into a 4-4-2 diamond really helped us. So whoever would shift to the outside would take on their outside defender. I think allowing our forwards to drop centrally and one of our midfielders to drop outside really helped us because then they weren't allowed to attack on the sideline so our outside defender didn't ca get caught off guard. I think the way Franklin Players was playing, you know, it made us feel a little uncomfortable. I think we didn't want to put them on a the strong foot and as a coach, that's my job to make some adjustments, you, you know, trick, trick teams here and there and I think we kind of tweak things out a little bit and we kind of offset them which work in our favor and which um, really help us to stay in the game and kept that lead. I think it was a lot of heart from all the girls. We knew what we needed to do. We knew we, that, that we needed this win and everyone just left it all out on the field and it was a great win for us. That we need to take this heart that we have and keep showing that we want this. We want to make playoffs and we need to keep working as a team and picking each other up. Again, it's just going to take a lot of heart. Whoever wants it more, we got to possess the ball and we got to finish. And that's what we need to do. That's a big challenge for us. You know, as you know, it's been consistency. We play well during the week, struggle on the weekend. So I hope with four games left and they know what at stake, I hope that we come out and we're ready to continue this performance all the way to the end of the season.